attention to them. When in the course of human events it becomes necessary for one people to dissolve the political bands which have connected them with another, and to assume among the powers of the earth the separate and equal station to which the laws of nature and of nature's God entitle them, a decent respect to the opinions of mankind requires that they should declare the causes which impel them to the separation. We hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal. They are endowed by their creator with certain unalienable rights that among these are life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. That to secure these rights, governments are instituted among men, deriving their just powers from the consent of the governed. That whenever any form of government becomes destructive to these ends, it is the right of the people to alter or abolish it and to institute new government laying its foundation on such principles and organizing its powers in such form as to them shall seem most likely to affect their safety and happiness. suffering with the same thing. So to come down and, and get women and children, it's going to help keep their numbers high. And so we saw that going on. Yeah, so it's, um, and then it's a lot later before westward expansion gets to Cherokee. Because I think the Henderson Purchase is in the 1780s where the top Cherokee land is sold and that's yeah, the rest of Virginia yes. comes off. It's right. called dog vein or Indian hemp. You can also use a milkweed. It has a fiber in it that you can use for this. And nettles. We work, they work differently because uh, the nettles you wet because the outsides of the nettles will tear you up. But this so doesn't. From so the, from the linen. Yes. Yeah. It does not take as much work. To get to the it fire. takes a lot of work. Not a, yeah, the linen you have to have all these special things to yeah. We can do we can work this with our hands. I work this with my hands when I do it. So you collect it, you get rid of all. In the, the fall, we, we collect it once it's gone in seed, so we know it will be there next year for us. Um, we bring it in. Uh, I take a stone and hit it and crack it open, and there's. The inside of it, the very inside of it, in the summer, it's a white latexy stuff in it. So you want to wait till it dries. And once you crack it open, I can bend the bark and just peel it down like that and remove the whole center piece of it. The only thing I'm left with is just the fibers and the outer bark. And by rubbing it in my hands like this, I crack the outer bark off and I'm left with the fibers. There are still some fibers on here but if there's a lot that's stuck on here, because we do this generally in the winter when you're around the fire, if I roll this over the fire, all the they little pieces burned. of bark will just come right off of it. Mm -hmm. 